In this chapter, we are going to explore how to take multiple part files and create an assembly from those parts. The result is a SolidWorks assembly file. If we take a look at the wheel assembly we have on the screen, you will notice the assembly is nothing more than several part files inserted, positioned, and mated to one another. For example, we have a wheel plate, a couple brackets, four pins, an axle, and a wheel. All individual part files inserted, positioned, and mated to one another. Our look at creating assemblies in this chapter will include the assembly environment and the feature manager design tree as it applies to assemblies. This will also include how to insert parts, position parts, and how to hide and show components in an assembly. Our chapter will conclude with a look at various methods of mating parts, such as the coincident, parallel, perpendicular, tangent, and concentric mates. At the completion of the chapter, you will be well versed in creating basic assemblies in SolidWorks.